Hi everyone, it's Jill with Greenwood Girl Cards and I am coming on to share some wonderful happy mail um, that I've gotten from my friend Muriel who's Miss Cooper's Coop here on YouTube and she's also the queen of Christmas tag making um, and I think that is what is inside this beautiful package here and um, I also have some unexpected happy mail from my friend Cindy Hosel who is daydreaming to create on YouTube and if you guys watched my curating Christmas video the other day I showed an ornament that she had made out of paper clay and I thought she wasn't making new videos anymore but she is and I went and watched a video she did um, where she's making some leather um, journals or um, TNs and um, they're just gorgeous so go check out her channel daydreaming to create and um, she she also has tons of videos of course from when she was a designer with whimsy and when she guest designed with greeting farm um, you know, there's just lots of good content on her channel, but her newest video is of these beautiful, gorgeous leather journals that she's making. So anyway, um, I will start sharing uh, the Happy Mail. And while I'm thinking of it, I also want to give a shout out to Felicia, who is Bible Scraps. She is the first um, curating Christmas video response. And um, her and Elise did a wonderful swap this year for Christmas also, and uh, they both love gingers, um, which as you guys know, I love gingers too, but you need to go check out both of their channels. Elise is Lisey46, and then Bible Scraps, uh, Felicia's channel, because um, they, they share their swaps. And if you love gingerbread as much as I do, and gingers, gingerbread men and gingerbread women, you will love what they both have to share. So, um, Anyway, on to these beautiful tags. Uh, Muriel packaged up um, the tags in this sweet bag, and I just love this. Look at how precious this is, making spirits bright. And she has this little clip on here that says, Made with Christmas Love. And that is such a clever way to decorate a bag. I love that. She just clipped the tag onto there, so I can even use this again. So, Muriel, thank you. That is just adorable. And then Muriel always makes the most incredible tags, you guys. And um, I actually had some of her tags out on my table from last year that I'm that the, I had a couple left that I didn't use. And uh, my sister and my nieces were here um, for a, an event that we went to last weekend, and they were, they were like looking at her tags and wanting them. And uh, so uh, just know Muriel that your tags are uh, admired by many. And um, look at how cute this is with these little red um, uh, flowered sequins as, as the holly berries. I just love that. And then at the top, inside, you can see it's a little envelope. And she, she has a little sticker here and then North Pole. So that is just adorable. I just love that. And uh, you could even put a message, because this is an envelope, you could even, like, uh, put a message inside of here. I don't know. I might use this on my December daily. I'm doing a digital December daily this year through Shutterfly. I'm going to have it printed into a book and I might add this in the front flap and put a note in it. So I think that's how I'm going to use this, Muriel. I just love this. It's so pretty. I just look at how those sequins sparkle. It's just gorgeous. And then there's this beautiful ornament that says happy holidays and look at the layers on this. This is just so pretty. I think this is a die and then I think she used, um, like gold paint marker on the edges. I'm trying to remember. Um, but anyway, isn't that lovely? It's three layers and beautiful papers. And then there's this one. I just love these little cars. Oh my gosh, those are so cute. It says, Be Merry. And look at all the detail Muriel adds. She's just an incredible tag maker. And I'm so glad that we share tag making together. It's, it's a lot of fun. Muriel always sends me some of her tags each year. Um, I had shared that I make tags for my family every year, and that's really how I um, I started sharing the tags on YouTube was because I make all these tags, and then I give them to families and uh, sometimes to a, um, a single parents group um, of women. Uh, anyway, different things with my church or the giving tree or whatever, and uh, so I... I uh, 
Muriel liked the idea of making tags and giving them as gifts at Thanksgiving, so she started doing it too, and she is so gracious and sends me some of her tags, and I'm, I'm so blessed to receive them, especially this year, Muriel, because I didn't get as many made, and I, I have very few left at this point. <laughs> so I will definitely be using some of these on my gift wrapping that I'm, I'm going to do this week. So look at this. She's got one of the little, I, I think these were maybe from Target. I'm not sure. I didn't get any, so I'm not sure, but I think maybe this was the little stockings from Target, I think. And then she's added the Noel, and just look at all the little details. And then in top, she has little packages tucked in here. So I don't know where you found those, but those are adorable. And then look at this little charm. It's a little green um, Christmas light charm that she has tied on. And then a little, um, oh, what do you call that? Pipe cleaner candy cane. That is just precious. And then she has the back little tag on there for writing. Oh my gosh, Muriel, I love this. Oh, it's just precious. I, I just am, I'm almost in tears. They're so cute. Look at this one. This one says Season's Greetings, and it has these cute little snowmen, which I just adore snowmen. This is really cool paper. I think maybe this is the Tim Holtz Christmas paper. I tried to get that paper this year, and I couldn't find it anywhere. So all the stores I went to, it was out, and I, I don't have a lot of time for shopping, you guys, so if it's not there, I just, I end up not getting things. <laughs> so um, anyway, and then look at this one. This one's in a little bag, so I'll, I'll leave it in there, but look at the detail with the flowers and the two from, and it's a little coffee mug or a latte cup, and look at that tag that says, Be Merry. That's really cute. Did you make that too, or did you find that somewhere? That's adorable. Look at all the little hollies and everything she tucks in. It's so pretty. And then there's the back on that one, so plenty of room to write. I don't know. I might have to put this one on my tree in the living room. I don't know. I, I, I hate to almost... Maybe this one I might use as an ornament. I don't know. I love them all, Muriel. Muriel, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Not just for sending the tags, but for your channel content all year um, and sharing all the things that you create. Um, Muriel is a master at repurposing, and uh, I love that she she's like me. We all we look at the uh, clearance racks a lot and look for things that we can use. And I do a lot of thrifting. Um, at least I used to. I don't do as much as I used to. Um, time wise, but um, it's, I, I just really enjoy what Muriel shares on her channel. And more importantly, she's a sweet, sweet woman and a beautiful mother and, a, and just a wonderful friend. So someday, Muriel, we're going to have to meet in person. <laughs> we really don't live that far apart, but we still haven't ever met in person. So someday. Um, so Mur Muriel, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you and to your daughter and, uh, you know, thank you so much. And uh, I'm going to move on now. <laughs> I'm almost at eight minutes already. So this beautiful card was made by Cindy Hosel. And Cindy, um, I was so surprised to have this package delivered um, to my doorstep and uh, to open this beautiful card. And uh, I'm so touched by what you wrote. And I actually cried <laughs> when I read your card. So um you touched me the same way, my friend, and uh, thank you from the bottom of my heart, and Merry Christmas to you and your beautiful family. But look at this gorgeous card, you guys. This is a beautiful stamp from Unity, and it's an angel, and it says believe. And she made this gorgeous background. I just love this. I'm going to have to, I, I don't know what I'm going to, I might even just frame this, Cindy, and put it up in my craft room because you know I love angels, and uh, I just think this is so beautiful. I'm choking up, so um, I'm so overwhelmed by, you know, the gifts. Muriel, Cindy, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for making my Christmas special. Um, and this is the gift that she sent. It's wrapped in this beautiful, beautiful um, fabric um, with all of this beading and stitches on it. So she used this as the wrapping paper, and I haven't opened this yet, so... It says, in here it says, just for you. This is a little box. It looks like it might have gotten a little bit crushed um, in the delivery. But what is in here? Oh, it is a little angel. Let's see if I can get it positioned here. It's a little angel charm that I can put on one of my chains and wear. Oh, that is beautiful. 
Oh, that's so sweet, Cindy. Thank you. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, thank you so much, Cindy. Look at all this stuff, you guys. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Cindy, in her note, said that she had been collecting things that she saw and had thought of me um, as she was thrifting. And uh, Cindy does a lot of thrifting and looking um, at estate sales and stuff. Look at this. And she knows I love angels and how angels are so special to me. Oh, that is just precious. Look at that, you guys. Look at the little bow. Oh, it's just an adorable little angel with a teddy bear. Oh, let's put, I'm going to set him right now for now. I'm going to set him in my dish of candy canes. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so cute. Okay. Oh, that just makes me smile, Cindy. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is so fun. I hope you guys are having fun watching. Um, and I hope you're all enjoying getting ready for Christmas. Oh my gosh, Cindy, what is this? Is this a frame ornament? It, it's a little frame, you guys, look at that. Oh, that is adorable. Let's see if I can open it. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, that is just precious. I love the picture that's actually in it. You know, you could almost just put this on your, I could put this on my shabby chic um, Christmas tree just like it is, or I can actually put a picture in it, I think. But you almost don't even need to because it's so pretty. That is just beautiful. I don't know where you found that, but it's adorable and it has a hanger on it, so I can just put it on my tree. It's going on my tree. <laughs> Oh, and there's two of them. Oh, and this one's a snowflake. They're both snowflakes, I think. Oh, those are just beautiful. Wow. Those are so perfect for my shabby chic tree. I can't even believe it. Wow. They almost look like my sister. <laughs> oh my goodness, thank you, Cindy. Oh, I'm so touched. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at you guys. She sent me, oh, look at the greenery. I don't have either one of these, I don't think. Or maybe I do have this one, I'm not sure. But, um, no, this one looks different than the one that I have, I don't know. But look at this, you guys, I just can't, Cindy, I cannot believe you did this. I will get a ton of use out of this. I've had my eye on this and I just haven't ordered it. So that is just wonderful. I just love all the different things. And I think this is the one that Muriel uses on her tags. You know, I was pointing out all the greens and I think this might be the set that Muriel has. Those are wonderful. Oh my goodness. You know that I will put those to good use. So thank you. Look at this. Oh, a Merry Christmas to you. Look at that beautiful vintage angel. Oh, that is just gorgeous and it's a card. But it's a vintage card. That image is just beautiful. Oh, I have to think what to do with that. Thank you. Oh, look at you guys. She sent me fabrics. There's some satin. I think that's satin. I'm not. I'm not up on all the different fabric type names. But look at this. This is a rocking chair one, and just such a pretty holly pattern in there too. Look at how cute that holly is. That'll be great for doing. Um, little strips or fat. Oh, look at this one. Um, you know, for my little fabric trees, I could use strips of these. Or as you know, I like to use um, fabric to make my ties for my tags. And then this is actually, um, uh, I think it's satin. Is it satin? Satin? I'm not sure. So, but gorgeous, gorgeous fabrics. Oh, thank you, Cindy. Oh my gosh. Oh, and look at this one. This one has like, um, almost like an embroidered pattern into it. I don't know what you call that, but it's gorgeous. So pretty. Wow, that'll be gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Oh, and there's another bag here. What's in this one? Oh, there's little tiny angels. Oh my gosh. Oh, here, I have to take them out so you can see you guys. Oh, they're so cute, Cindy. Oh my goodness, and there's a bunch of them. 
and they're little tiny ornaments or you could use them on tags or do all sorts of different things with them oh my gosh and they're just precious look at how cute they are oh those are just precious I've never seen those before and there's a whole bunch of them oh playing horns and oh they're just precious and there's even more in here look at these ones Let's see if I can get this open oh look at you guys this is a little one playing a flute these are little ornaments I'm gonna to have to put some of these on the tree <laughs> I might even have to put them all on the tree oh my gosh they're just so perfect for my tree this year my craft room tree is going to look so gorgeous. Look at this one. Oh. oh, Cindy, you find the sweetest vintage items. I'm assuming these are vintage too. Oh, they're just precious. I think that one might have gotten a little bit. Oh, that one has a chip from something inside of it. I'll get it out later. Here, there's a piece stuck inside of it that must have broken off somewhere. But look at that. Oh, they're just precious. Oh, one of them broke, but I can glue it because it's just the wing. It'll be easy to fix. Oh, they're so sweet. Oh my gosh. All right. I'm going to put the little piece of wing in here so I can glue it. My husband, Stuart, he used to fix anything that I broke. He would always glue it for me and uh, make them look good as new. So I know how to do it. This is awesome. Oh, they're so sweet. Those angels just touched my heart. Oh my goodness. All right. And then what else did she send? She sent where angels walk. Oh my gosh. The stories of heavenly visitors. Oh, I am going to love this. You know, I still read to my son every night. Um, before we go to sleep, we still do some reading every night and I, I still read out loud to him. So we'll be reading this, Cindy. Um, thank you so much. This is, it's a New York times bestseller. That is awesome. Oh, Thank you. I, I just, I'm so overwhelmed. And then look at this, you guys. This is a Debbie Mum. I love Debbie Mum. And I think I mentioned that recently in one of my videos. But look at how sweet these are. These are Debbie Mum. Look at the angel. Oh my gosh. Look at it. It's angels. It's just so precious. Oh, you guys. Well, I don't even know what to say. Um, Cindy, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Um, for touching me and uh, for thinking of me uh, and just for being such a sweet friend and uh, I send my love to you and your family Muriel the same I send my love to you and your daughter Mia and I just I uh, I wish you guys the merriest of Christmases I pray that you have many blessings both of you, both of you and your families throughout the new year and um, I just thank you from the bottom of my heart so thanks for making my Christmas extra special and um, God bless you both. God bless your families. And really, God bless everybody. I will be back to share more. Um, I hope you guys will participate in Curating for Christmas by leaving a comment on my video. You'll be eligible for, um, it's my last video, the one right before this one. And um, if you leave a comment, you will be eligible to possibly win this set of stamps from Unity. So it's a set of three different stamps and you can go watch the video and all you have to do is leave a comment and tell me what your favorite Christmas icon is. So whether it's snowman or reindeer or Santa's or whatever and or angels. And um, if you want to do a video response, I'm also doing a prize for, um, for all the people that do a video response. I'll be drawing a name for a $25 